Hey guys, how's it going? Long time no see. I don't know if my camera's messed up or not, because it hasn't been turned on for like a year. It made me go through all the resetting stuff, and apparently the battery died all the way. So hey, we're back. It's been a while. Knife video, not this time, but I will show a new knife. But we're going to do a hot sauce. Because it's raining and they have time off from work. So. But it's kind of dark in here. And since the last time I did something to fix that. And so much light you get for $14. Oh, jeez. Yep. Let's kill this one. Now we're blind. Oh, that is not flattering light. <laughs> no, not particularly. Look at the thing that's pretty horrific. All right, let's get into this here. Angry Goat Pepper Company. Purple Hippo Hot Sauce. Oh, Prickly Pear. It's not pear. It's Prickly Pear and Scorpion. It is a 2016 SCOVY winner, which I've never been to the SCOVYs, so come on, focus. There we go. Well, whatever. Uh, here's the interesting front. And we have prickly pear cactus juice. Agave nectar, habanero peppers, jalapeno peppers, red bell peppers, apple spider vinegar, strawberries, pure cane sugar, lemon juice, lime juice, sea salt, and scorpion peppers. Hmm. Scorpion peppers is the last ingredient, so we might survive this. It's been a long time since I had anything super hot. Yeah, it's not going to be that bad. Well, I don't think it will be. Now, I was scared at first until I read the pepper is the bottom of the ingredients, so it'll probably be alright, right? I mean, like, it was the least <sighs> scary of the super hot options that we had. At least I thought so. I'm going to be opening this today with this. Uh, I forget what he called them, but basically it's a lion steel uh, Barlow. Go on, focus. Focus. It's not going to focus. Anyway. Uh, Lion Steel. Courtesy of, uh, Collector's Knives. In M390. Titanium bolsters, liners. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Probably till I have to sharpen it. So. Technically, I didn't need a knife. I just wanted to use it. <coughs> so, how you all been? Long time no see. Yeah, how long has it been since our last? It's been a long time, and most of the people I normally watch are gone. Left the YouTubes. I didn't leave the YouTubes, I just got busy. Well, that really thickened up when I shook it. Oh, yeah. Alright. Can you smell the pain? Smells like something I've smelled before. Oh yeah. Smells well, potent. That smells like hiccups. Lots of smells coming out of there. Could could smell like hiccups. Yeah, smells just, good. That just smells like a straight up pepper sauce. Really potent. But we'll find out. Oh, 
does it show you the color? Yeah, you can see the color. Actually, it looks brighter on there than it does on Funny thing uh -oh. is, I had, like, no bit of nervousness uh -oh. going into this. Uh-oh. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, I'm not going to do that much. Okay, so here we go. There's your color. Kind of chunky. A little bit chunky. Which is good. <coughs> wow, the smell's kind of making me cough. Yeah, I haven't done too much for super spicy myself. Yeah, so it's alright. Just put yourself a good spoonful and. Alright, well. <laughs> Here goes uh, Purple Hippo, Prickly Pear and Scorpion. Yeah, Purple Hippo. By Angry Goat Pepper Company. We'll see if he should be called Purple Pain. It's been a long time since I had hot stuff. Three, two, one, go. Hmm. That's interesting. Oh, the flavor's amazing. But right away. Chunky. Cool flavor. Yeah, right away that heat goes. Hard to talk. I know. <laughs> told, told you I smelled hiccups. Hiccups. <laughs> Ooh. The flavor, though. Unbelievable. <coughs> Definitely get oh. a, get a very fruity. Choking on my spit. Flavor right away. And then it goes to the um, pepper pretty immediately after. Oh. Oh, that's some hot stuff there. Glad you can talk. You also took a little bit more than I did. I, uh... I'm right back. <laughs> I need, um... The bowl. Really? Yeah. It delivers a good amount of spice. It is got a good amount of chunkiness, like good thickness. I am a bigger fan of the um, the chunky bowl. hot sauce over the thinner ones. It's got a really good flavor immediately. Yeah, chunky little bits of stuff. Second, you get past the flavor though. Like you taste it for a second, then your mouth's on fire. Yeah. What started out right in my throat, that's why I couldn't talk. Really? Yeah. I didn't now, really get the throat burn at all. Now it's all on fire. Pretty pretty good overall mouth burn. That's... <laughs> I really like this stuff. Okay. Flavor? I can, I can see why it was an award winner for flavor. Flavor's solid 4 out of 5. Yeah. Yeah, solid 4. Really good. Heat? That's uh, a... A little bit more spicy than, uh... Oh, crap. Most people would want. Now, what... The thing I'm trying to think of is... Yeah, what yeah, yeah, good yeah, with. That's definitely for a chili head. That's... I'm trying to think of, like, something it would go good with. I don't know. But I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what it would go good with. But I mean, really anything that's got, that goes well with like a good fruity flavor. Sorry about that. Just cleaning the mess. Maybe some of the sweat off the upper lip. Whew. Yeah, that was hot. Yeah, I really like it. This burn is holding on. Yeah, I'm getting it like right <sighs> in the center of the tongue. Uh, 
again, flavor wise, that's pretty damn awesome. I would recommend that. You do gotta like spicy uh, stuff. Yeah, though. you gotta like spicy for sure. It, uh, whew. Whew. Like, it's really hard to get, like, a good high heat it with a good flavor and have it balance well. Yeah, well, that, came, that does a good job that of it. That came close to making me go, uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> We're unhappy. Not that bad. No, no, I got it under control. It didn't take long, but initially. Yeah. So yeah, um I'm not, I I'm not sure it. where you would find it, but if you find it. It is definitely worth a try. And your lack of the hot stuff. I'd say give it a try. But with food. Definitely belongs on food, not by itself. Like we've tried a lot of hot sauces and when it comes to flavor, that's definitely up there. Yeah, that is up there for the flavors. Like, the only one that I can think of that, like, surpasses that in flavor was the, uh, Pex one. Oh, the blueberry one. The yeah. berry one that was really good on ice cream. That was good. That's, like, the only sauce that I would put above that in flavor. That I, that at least comes to mind. What about Cholula Chipotle? <laughs> Love that sauce. It goes on everything. It does. <laughs> That's like a regular... Alright guys, well, good seeing you again. I'll try to make videos more often. Take care, have a great one, and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.